Today we're in 1 Kings chapter 16. And this is kind of a, well, really it's sort of a depressing chapter. It's about these different kings that would be raised up in Israel. And, and I'm going to mention some of their names. It's King Basha, Elah, Zimri, Amri, and Ahab. And it seems like each king got worse. As we go through this chapter in 1 Kings, one would raise up, another one would be taken down. And the final one that they mention is Ahab. And this is what it says about Ahab. Listen to what it says. And Ahab made a wooden image. And Ahab did more to provoke the Lord God of Israel to anger than all the kings of Israel who were before him. So in other words, he's the baddest king there's ever been. He did more to provoke the Lord, to make the Lord angry than any other king. And we've seen four or five already go down in this one chapter. But here's the thing. Kings would raise up. Kings would be taken down. But God made a promise to Israel that he'd bless them, that out of them would come a Messiah, would come a great king one day that would rule and reign over Israel. And that king is Jesus Christ. That king not only came and was birthed through Israel, so to speak, but he also died for Israel and for the sins of all mankind. And one day, Scripture tells us that the greatest king of all, greater than any king that ever ruled over Israel, greater than King David, greater than Solomon, this King Jesus would come and he'll rule and reign over Israel. And he'll do nothing to provoke God to anger. In fact, he'll do all that's pleasing in the Father's sight. And we're looking forward to that king coming back one day and ruling and reigning because God promised us that we will have a king and he will rule over Israel.